I'll introduce a uh, small event to you. It's handball, and uh, uh, for the next time, I'll bring, uh, bring some handballs, and we can practice how to play it. Okay. Um, and uh, what is handball? Handball, also known as team handball, is a team sport in which two teams of seven players each pass the ball to three teams with the girls of nine teams. It didn't tell us nothing, right? Uh, so. Uh, for easy to understand what is handball, it's a mixture of soccer and basketball. And I will show you why it's a mixture of, of soccer and basketball in, uh, in the following slides. Uh, and uh, first, first talking about the original and the uh, development of the handball. Uh, the team handball game of today was uh, qualified at the end of the 19th century in Northern uh, Europe, probably in Denmark, Germany, Norway, or Sweden. Uh, and the first international game was played between Germany and uh, Belgium for men's in uh, 1925 and uh, between Germany and uh, Austria uh, for women in 1930. Uh, men's team handball was aided at the 1972 Summer Olympics in the Berlin and uh, uh, women's was aided at the 1976 Summer Olympics. And uh, uh, at, at that time, I need to introduce the really, really, really basic rules for the handball. Uh, the first one is after receiving the ball, players can pass, keep possession, or shoot the ball. It's the same as uh, basketball, right? If you hold the ball in the basketball, you can pass it, you can shoot it, you can uh, dribble. And uh, in handball, it's, it's the same. And uh, but but uh, there's difference between the basketball and the handball uh, because uh, if you possess the ball in the handball, uh, you can you can dribble and uh, you can run for three steps. Uh, in basketball, it's only two steps, but in handball, it's three steps, and uh, you can only hold the ball for three seconds. In basketball, you can, you can hold a long time, perhaps 24, 24 seconds for for, uh, for attack, but in the handball, it's only three three seconds. And uh, and the uh, and three three rules is uh, no attacking or defining players other than the defining goalkeepers are allowed to touch the floor of the goal area. Uh, what is the goal area? We will show you in the next slide. And uh, a shooter pass in the goal area is valid if complete before touching the floor. It tells us that uh, we can jump uh, uh, after the, after the, after the, the goal line, and we can jump into the goal area before uh, uh, if I complete the, the shoot or pass before I touch the uh, touch the floor. And, and the goalkeeper are allowed outside the goal area, but are not allowed to possess the ball across the goal area boundary. It told us that uh, if I'm goalkeeper, I can I can run out of the uh, the goal area of, of our our, uh, our areas, but I cannot move into the uh, opponent's goal area if I'm goalkeeper. And uh, okay, uh, so it's a. Uh, a uh, playing field of the of the handball is uh, is similar like a like a soccer, okay. And uh, it's a goal area. It's a goal area. It's six meters. Um, and uh, uh, the the attacker players cannot uh, uh, cannot set up set foot into into these areas, but he can jump here to here and uh, shoot the ball. Okay. And it's seven players. And uh, the another similarities of the of the uh, uh, soccer and the handball is uh, is the appearance of the ball. Although the the um, the handball was uh, smaller smaller than the soccer, you can hand it. Uh, only if you your hand is larger than me, you can you can hold it. <laughs> okay, my hand is really small, so I can hand, I can hold it. Uh, so you can you can hold it either. And uh, uh, they have uh, two lines. It's the uh, goal lines, as uh, as we have seen, I have uh, taught uh, uh, before. You cannot set the into its area. And the outside lines is a free through line. Uh, 
if uh, if the defined player's uh, force um, and the, the attack the attack players will uh, take the free through uh, to, uh, take the free through um, uh, after the this lines they cannot they cannot uh, take the free through in the lines and uh, they have uh, two small lines in here. It's a uh, uh, panic lines and it's a panic lines and goalkeeper lines. Uh, if there is a goalkeeper, uh, there, there, there is a penalty. Uh, the attack players need to after these lines. He need to stand here, and the goalkeeper uh, should stand uh, before these lines. Okay, it's three meters. And um, okay, and uh, uh, the. the uh, the handballs were uh, the handballs had a uh, uh, two two thirty minutes half uh, and uh, ten and ten minutes half time breaks. Uh, and then I'll show you some excellent plays of the of the handball. If you, if you have a, a very good uh, a good job that you can and it's very popular in Europe. Common uh, for one game, each uh, the, the, the score of, of each team is between twenty to thirty. And in the end, uh, in the end, today uh, I introduced the handball to our viewers and. Uh, uh, if you are interested in handball and want to play it, you can search Open University Handball Club on Facebook. It's a new club. So you can learn with many novices. And novices too. And novices too, yeah. Uh, it's pretty good. Uh, and uh, and next, next time, I'll show you how to play it. Uh, and I, I just have learned, learned how to play it, but perhaps I can tell you how to play it. Okay. That's all. Yeah, any questions?